What is up guys, Castron Gaming here, and today we are going to be checking out and reviewing the Dinka Ballista Kanjo. Now this did come out with the Diamond Casino Heist DLC, and it's $580,000, which is not a bad price for this, and the trade price is $435,000, and before I get into anything, if you can't tell already what this is based off of, this is based off of the 1998 FK9 Honda Civic Type R. It's kind of a mouthful there, but it's a really good looking car. I like it, and yeah, have it right here. You guys don't have to wait. I like, I just, I like the body style of it. The body style looks pretty good, and I already changed the plate beforehand because my Rockstar or my um my uh, iFruit app wasn't working, so. I changed the plate already and just put VTEC on it because I thought that fits this car perfectly. And um, yeah, let's get into the customization. I really like those wheels as well. Alright, it is in the compacts class as well, which makes sense. Alright, so armor, brakes, bumpers. So we have the half primary splitter. That looks pretty nice. I like that. Full primary splitter. Okay. Sticker bomb bumper. Street bumper. Just it gives you the um, two little vents on the side, and that it fills in the bottom right there. That's I really like that. And track bumper, street bumper with canards, light and bumper, light and street bumper, highway brace, highway racer bumper. Oh my, race day bumper. Extreme aero bumper time attack bumper. This looks like the Batmobile and that's it Um, I think I'm gonna roll with the street bumper cuz yeah, I like that. That looks pretty good Rear bumper so we have primary trim Subway ring which basically just gives you a little tow hook right there. I like that primary trim and subway ring that looks even nicer sticker bomb bumper light in bumper light in bumper and diffuser street SPL bumper Highway racer bumper, oh Jesus. Lightweight track bumper, time attack bumper, stripped and small diffuser, stripped and medium diffuser, oh my God, stripped and large diffuser. Wow, Um, I think I'm gonna go with the uh, primary trim with subway ring, that looks pretty cool. Doors, so we have wind deflectors, carbon wind deflectors, and window nuts. Not really a big fan of any of those. So we're just gonna leave that. Engine, exhaust, so we have the dual exit exhaust. For it to stop revving, dual exit exhaust. Just rev it so I remove the smoke. Dual exit, tuner exhaust, that looks really nice. Chrome tuner exhaust, track, track exhaust, chrome track exhaust, performance exhaust, all right, chrome performance exhaust. Big bore exhaust, chrome big bore exhaust, blast pipes, and Shackleton pipes. That is ridiculous. It's so ridiculous, I like it. Um, yeah, I think we're gonna roll with the tuner exhaust because the track exhaust, the track exhaust would be good. You can't really see it, but the track exhaust would be good. It's just it sticks out a lot along with the chrome track. So we're just gonna get the tuner exhaust. That looks really good. Fender, so we have sticker bomb front fenders, sticker bomb front and rear. So you can sticker bomb the front fenders and the rear butt fenders. Uh, vented, vented, vented front fenders. That looks really nice. I like that. Street fenders. So that kind of that gives you like a mild wide body at the back. Okay. Carbon street fenders, track fenders, carbon track fenders, race fenders. Okay, so that gives you like a huge wide body at the back with, actually it's the same wide body, it just has vents on, on, vents on it. Uh, carbon race fenders, and that's it. Um, we're going to roll with the vented front fenders, that looks really good, I like that. Grill, so we have primary grill surround, okay, I really like that logo by the way. Uh, D-badged grill, exposed intercooler, black Dinka intercooler, and white Dinka intercooler. Intercooler with water sprayer and intercooler with two with twin fans. I would like these grills better if they had the badge on them because everything above the primary 
uh, everything above the primary grill is um, debadged. Um, but I guess like this kind of represents it. It says Dinka on the bottom right there. Um, yeah, we'll go with the white Dinka, I guess. Headlights, so we have yellow headlights. Uh, that's odd, yellow headlight glass, okay. Primary headlight covers, secondary headlight covers, primary headlight intake, that looks odd. Secondary headlight intake and carbon headlight intake. Um, I don't like any of these. I don't like the intakes and I also don't like the yellow headlight glass. So we're just gonna leave that. Hood, so we have the stock hood, which looks pretty, it looks, it looks plain, but it also looks good. We have the hood bra, secondary color hood, Sticker bomb hood, rusty hood, carbon hood, lifted primary. And I know there's people who like lifted hoods, but why <laughs> is the is um the real question here? Lifted secondary hood, lifted carbon hood, street hood. Okay, that looks pretty ugly. Carbon street hood, performance hood, carbon performance hood. Race hood, yuck. Carbon race hood. Oh my god. Big turbo hood. That is hilarious. What the. What is that? I mean, that looks super cool, actually. Um, But I'm not a huge fan of it. You know? Because I feel like it's just so out there. Like, maybe if it just had, like, a little bit sticking out. This, uh, this has, like, three quarters of it sticking out. It would have been better if it was just like half. Um, oh, I don't know. The performance hood looks pretty good. Uh, we'll get the performance hood. Lights. So it comes stock with yellow headlights. That looks pretty good. Uh, so we're just going to leave that. Livery. So we have street decals. Okay. Shopping list just says can't oh wait no 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 it has a little something right there. Is that oh, yeah, it has something in the back. What does that say? You suck. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry. You suck. That's that's what the sticker says. Alright, Clubman Racer. What is okay. That's strange. It has a number thing. Like where it would number would be, but there's no number in there. Total bucket, just rusted. Uh, Outlaw Racer, that looks pretty cool. I like that. Um, it says something right here. It says, Too slow, Mr. Policeman. Oh my god. That is hilarious. That actually is hilarious. Highway Hunter, that's pretty cool. Midnight Champion. Okay. Atomic Motorsport. Globe Oil Racing. Tinka Race Team. Retro Fukuru, that also looks pretty cool. And Shiny Wasabi Kitty. It wouldn't be a Japanese car without shiny wasabi kitty on it. Um, I think we're going to go for the outlaw racer. This looks really cool. Play. We already changed the play. Yellow and black. Respray. I kind of like what state it's in right now. But maybe that looks really cool. But maybe like a grayish color. Yeah. The, the gray looks good. The gray like actually looks really good. Like it, 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 it shouldn't look as good as it does, basically. Um, but I also like the ice white on it. Um, yeah, I like that gray. Silver, actually. Um, whatever, we'll just keep it white. And secondary color will change the mirrors on it. But I think since you got the livery, um, kind of stuck with that. So we're just going to keep it what it is. And then your crew emblem would go right on the side right there. Roll cage, so we have the street half cage. Right, that's pretty good, nice. Track half cage, that's really cool. I like how it says Dinka on it. You guys probably can't see that, but it says Dinka on it. Um, dash dodger cage, padded dash dodger cage, full roll cage, and padded full roll cage. Um, I almost just like the street one because this I mean this is like a street look so Yeah, we're gonna go for the street half cage roofs. We have secondary roof sticker bomb roof 
carbon roof that looks really nice roof box roof rack and off to the track that's also really funny um actually we'll just keep it stock actually yeah skirts so we have primary skirts secondary skirts sticker bomb skirts street skirts carbon street skirts race skirts and carbon race skirts what I don't like about the the street skirt is that it has that little thing at the back I'm not sure if you guys can see that I'm zooming in on it it kind of like sticks out I don't really like that um, so we'll just we'll just keep it stock so we have the primary OEM wing that looks really nice too slow mr. policeman secondary OEM wing sticker bomb OEM wing carbon OEM wing primary raised wing all right secondary raised wing primary flap wing secondary flap wing street wing and also you might want to get uh, one of these because it does add to the traction bar as you can see drift wing GT wing track wing time attack wing street SPL wing all right oh my god when the when the spoiler is wider than the actual car that's that's wow um brace wing all right loop battle wing circuit master and that's it these wings are absolutely ridiculous so i think i'm just gonna roll with the primary oem wing looks pretty cool sun trips i don't like sun trips but i mean the dinka racing looks pretty good on it all right, primary sun trip Suspension, so we have lowered, street, sport, and competition. You could see, obviously, see the wheels cambering right there. Um, I don't like that. I'm not gonna go for that kind of look. Um, I like the street suspension. It's because it's kind of low, but it's not like as low, or it's not like too low to where the wheels camber like that. So we get street suspension, transmission, trunk. So we got primary color trunk. All right. Uh, secondary color trunk, sticker bomb trunk, and carbon trunk. Um, what does that say? Can't see what that says. Um, oh, it says oh, it says Fukuru on it. Okay. Um, I like the primary. Yeah, the primary looks really nice. Turbo wheels. So we have. I, I was thinking the Rally Master wheels, because those those look really good in like black or something. I don't know. Oh my God! Yeah, that looks good. Never mind. Um, custom tires, no. Tire enhancements, yes. Bulletproofs. Um, windows. So we have light smoke, dark smoke, and limo. Um, the limo. I like the limo tint because it kind of like flows in with it. Um, okay, that's too tinted. Uh, dark smoke, sure. And that's it. And I've actually changed my mind about the hood. Uh, I got. Um, sure, sure, sure. Why not? And exit to ground. Let's see how this handles. I can imagine it to handle pretty well. <laughs> oh God, for what it is though. Yeah, this does look pretty cool out in the daytime. I will say. This front wheel drive, as you could anticipate. Um, Alright, let's check out the steering on it. Yep, okay, it has a little bit of oversteer, but... Or wait, does it? Hold on, let's take it around this one right here. Oh no, if anything, it has understeer. Um, let's try and drift onto the pier. I don't think it'll work well, because we have the... Um, we have the max brakes. Um, all right, um, let's try and do a burnout, even though it's front wheel drive, because why not? No, I'm not saying why not, because it's front wheel drive. I'm saying why not to do a burnout. <laughs> That's hilarious. That's just hilarious to see a front wheel drive car doing a burnout. That's yeah. That's just hilarious to see. Um, so let's take her in this alleyway right here. I don't know, I just found the most rent. You can go. You can go, sir. You can go. Yeah, let's just take it into right here. Don't, oh my God, I was so close to scraping it. 
Let's see how many things open on it exactly. Um, yeah, I got. I could picture everything, but all. Wow, look at that. Look at all the tubing and stuff. Dude, this, okay, this has to be the most detailed car ever. Look at that. That is actually amazing. Wow, okay, let's check out the trunk. Pretty generic, I like how the roll cage goes into it. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Do I recommend it? Yes, the customization on it is absolutely amazing. You can make this thing look absolutely ridiculous and it, it will still look good in a way. And for the price, it's 580000 compared to all the other vehicles we have that barely have any customization. That's a good price. Like that, that, That's a really good price. But, um, yeah, guys, if you did enjoy, please leave a like to let me know and see you in the next one.